House Tully, a first man house hailing from the Riverlands, follows distinctive funeral customs that diverge from the practices of followers of the old and new gods. Unlike other followers of the Faith of the Seven, who entrust their deceased to the Silent Sisters for burial, or the old gods' devotees who enter their dead in crypts beneath their castles, the Tullys observe a unique tradition. In the Tully funeral rites, a departed member is laid on a small boat and may be adorned in their armor and surcoat, equipped with a wooden sword and shield placed upon their cloak amid stones to add weight to the vessel, and surrounded by driftwood, kindling, and scraps of parchment to facilitate ignition, the funeral boat is a symbolic vessel. To pay homage to the faith, seven individuals are chosen to propel the boat into the water. The final act involves igniting the boat with a flaming arrow. Catelyn Tully summarizes this tradition by stating, The Tullys drew their strength from the river, and it was to the river they returned when their lives had run their course.